More than 5 million tons of metal are processed in German foundries each year and demand for increasingly effective materials continues to grow. In particular, the automotive and aviation industries increasingly demand lighter components that are also extremely strong and durable. To ensure such properties, metallic materials must be extremely pure and free of defects. But how can the number of impurities in metal melts be significantly reduced during the manufacturing process? Since 2011, scientists at TU Berg Academy Freiberg have been searching for solutions. In the Collaborative Research Center 920, a team of experts work on innovative filter materials and filter systems made of ceramics. Such filters reduce the number of non-metallic inclusions, improving the quality of the metallic material immensely. We have been successfully applied our functionalized filters in a modified casting mold. Through a functionalization, more than 95% of the inclusions have been eliminated from the steel mill. Such kind of reactive contribution we'd like to apply also in continuous casting. Their experiments on the continuous casting of steel led the scientists to Duisburg in Germany, the home of Tussenkrupp Steel Europe AG, one of the world's leading manufacturers of flat steel. Up to 12 million tonnes of pig iron are produced here every year. In the development of high-purity steels, the steel giant also relies on the expertise of the scientists from TU Berg Academy Freiberg. I hope that this research work will lead to a new approach in the production of flat steel on a large scale, the ability to filter out even the tiniest inclusions from steel. This is because small inclusions lead to failure of the material and thus to rework, leading to higher costs for our customers. This doesn't just happen in automotive engineering, but also in industrial applications like packaging material. And this is a first approach to avoiding such defects in the future. The new filters are implemented in the Tunbisch, an 86-ton distribution funnel. This is where they encounter realistic conditions for the first time, a metal melt at almost 1,600 degrees Celsius. In the first funding period of the Collaborative Research Centre, researchers successfully investigated and identified which filter materials and structures are capable of withstanding the high stresses involved. Meanwhile, filter systems based on ceramic foam structures can now be produced at dimensions suitable for industrial applications. The goal now is to apply the optimized filters modeled by computer in practical applications. Geometrically complex shapes from regenerative manufacturing processes are particularly promising. But can the scientists from TU Freiberg also achieve the targeted multifiltration of diverse inclusions? The development of smart filter systems with both active and reactive filter surfaces is a major step in achieving this goal. Not only can the ceramic foam filters be used to remove undesirable particles from the molten metal, but also dissolved gases. Polycrystalline layers are the key to the filter's efficiency. These layers are formed on the functionalized surfaces of the filter matrix during casting, trapping very fine inclusions and thus separating them out of the melt. The functionalization of the filter surface, for example by electrospinning, can significantly reduce the instance of non-metallic inclusions in steel and aluminium melts. Nanofunctionalized filter materials allow us to achieve higher levels of filtration capacity and efficiency while maintaining long-term filter stability. In order to observe the interactions between the functionalized filter surfaces and inclusions, the scientists use state-of-the-art analytical methods that allow them to penetrate even into atomic structures. On the basis of their research results, they are now in a position to create 4D visualizations of filtration processes and ultimately to develop tailor-made filtration systems. This innovation is critical for the production of materials that make technical inventions lighter and more durable, saving fuel, emissions and materials. All of these advantages are driving the team of experts to meet tomorrow's quality requirements by researching multifunctional filters for metal melt filtration. 
They are supported by the German Research Foundation with funding of approximately 2 million euros a year. The focus of the Collaborative Research Centre is increasingly on transferring research results into practical applications. Every metal melt presents different challenges. Aluminium melt, for example, tends to react with oxygen and ambient moisture, leading to undesirable non-metallic inclusions. With the development of active and reactive surface coatings, it is possible to alter the properties of the filter for a more effective removal of these non-metallic inclusions. The intensive cooperation between 11 institutes at Tate Wuberg Academy Freiburg will continue until 2023. Analyzing how smart filter systems will perform in the future and how new metallic components will behave under stress. This application-oriented research is contributing to new solutions in metal melt filtration and ultimately to the new technologies and materials of the future. This innovation will lead not only to the sustainable use of resources, but will also be the key to the capacity for innovation and the competitiveness of Germany as a business location.